Hey, this is Marshall from Going Gear, and today we're going to take a look at the Sunway M40A. It's powered by four AA batteries, and it has a Cree MCE bulb in there. Nice and bright, nice and compact. So we'll go ahead and open it up, show you what's on the inside. There's the light itself. Let's put that to the side for now, show you what's underneath the foam. You have a lanyard, spare O-rings, instructions, warranty card, all that standard stuff. Put that to the back for now, and uh, here's the light. Uh, like uh, most of other the other uh, Sunway lights, except for the L series, uh, all the lights in the M series are controlled by a magnetic ring. So you just turn that to switch between the modes, and it has no switch on the back, because so that's actually how you turn it on as well. Let's put some batteries in here, and we'll show you the interface for it. Open that up, take out the battery carrier. You can see it's a nice, sturdy little battery carrier. We're going to put four AA batteries in there, and get this guy going show you the inside while it's opened up. Put that back in there. Put it back together. So like I said, the switch actually turns, or the, the ring actually turns it on as well. So you have three different brightnesses. One, two, three. And then your last position is strobe. So one, two, three, and then strobe really good feeling ring, uh, moves really smoothly, nice and easy to switch between the modes. So we give you some close-ups of the different parts of the light. There's the reflector and the uh, that 4 Cree MCE down in there. You can see the styling of the light, really well machined, great anodizing on it. There's the ring, you see it move a little bit better. There's the other parts of the light, the back of it, like I said, there's no switch just the ring. So that is the M40A. We'll show you it compared to the uh, M30A just so you can get a difference or an idea of the difference between the sizes of the two. You can see the M30A is a little bit more compact. It's only using three double A's and uh, it has about half the brightness. So there's the two. Alright, we're going to go ahead and take this guy outside and we'll see how this does outside. Alright, we've got the M40A and we're going to be comparing it to the standard 40 mag light that I always use. So we'll give that mag light a try first. So here's my house, it's about 50 yards away. And there's a tree in the front yard that's about 100 yards away. I can barely see what's going on in, in the tree. Uh, so I imagine the video is probably not going to show up at all. So let's try the M40A, see how it does. There it is on low. Uh, I can see most of what's going on in my backyard pretty well. I can make out the details of my house, especially the reflective stuff. I doubt you guys are seeing anything on video. Tree, can't really see it all. There it is on medium. As you can see, stuff shows up a lot better on medium. And the tree, I can make out most of the details on it pretty well. And on high, I can make out everything. All the tree shows up and are probably much further than that would show up as well. My house, I can make out all the details and see the individual bricks on it and everything. So that is it for the Sunway M40A. If you have any questions, you can reach us in the comments or at goinggear.com. If you like the light, you can get it from us at goinggear.com. And if you like the videos, be sure to subscribe. We have tons of videos on flashlights, fire starters, all kinds of other stuff. Thanks for watching.